This is Reed Seals for AM 1340 WGRV. I'm here with 5th District Commissioner uh, candidate on the Republican ticket, Joseph Hauser. And Joseph, first off, just tell us a little bit about yourself. Well, first of all, I'd like to say thank you uh, to you and also to WGRV for this opportunity to be able to uh, tell my position and everything to the Green County people. Uh, my name is Joseph Hauser. I'm running for County Commissioner in the 5th District. Um, I've been a Green County citizen for a little over 30 years now. Moved to Green County when I got married back in 1988 out of North Carolina. Um, since I've lived in Green County, I've been a uh, supervisor at uh, multiple plants uh, in the automotive industry for over 15 years. So I've had uh, much training and much leadership in the Toyota uh, system. Uh, been able first first through first uh, slim uh, line running, uh, so I know how to do budgets and I know how to be a leader. What made you decide to run for election for commissioner? Well, I love Green County and I love the people in Green County, and as I've said, I've lived in Green County for a little over 50, 30 years now, uh, close to thirty years. Um, I have seen many changes in Green County since I've lived in Green County. I've seen a lot of good jobs go out. I've seen a lot of uh, agriculture go out. Uh, but more than anything is the attitude, uh, especially of the young people that I see around now. And as I look at that and I look at the county commission and I look at leaders and I see how that the professionalism a lot of times is not there that I ought to be. Um, and I want to be an example to the young people in Greene County. I want to... Uh, be able to lead and show professionalism in working in the departments and working with the departments of Greene County. Um, and I think that's the only way that we can have a positive impact on our county is to uh, show a positive leadership skills and be professional in that that we do. Now the hot topic right now is school consolidation. What is your opinion on that? I am totally against school consolidation. Um, I foresee many issues with that. I realize when you back up and look at this, and I realize why the question even comes up of school consolidation is there is an issue in the county as far as registration uh, dwindling and going down. However, uh, we have to look at the people aspects of this, not just uh, what is it money uh, for the peop some people's pocketbooks, but um, for our children traveling from the ends of the county to come to one location, I think is uh, not a very good solution to the problem that we have. In my years of supervision, uh, I've had many classes of problem solving. Um, I've learned to dig down deep and get to the root cause of issues. Um, and I'm afraid that a lot of times in the county commission and in the local government, the two solutions that people come up with is either cut it out or throw taxes at it. And I think that uh, it needs to be looked at closer and look and see what we can do, but also to leave these schools in the districts where they're at uh, and where they've been for many years. I, I do not like all the issues that come. You make one uh, big school uh, in a central location, you lose all the personal touch that the teachers have with each other, uh, with the students and with the teachers. Uh, you lose, uh, you have a lot of congested traffic, um, and I feel like that you have a lot of the issues that we see around the country in our schools that we're not experiencing at this time in Greene County. So I'm totally against school consolidation, and I think it needs to be looked at and see what can we do to leave the schools right where they're at and try to help and work on the issue that we have. And what are your plans, if any, if you do get elected commissioner? My plans as a commissioner is to try to do the best job that I can do for the people of Greene County, um, you know, and to work with the um, other departments. Uh, the county commissioners are the ones that govern the the county. They actually oversee the budgets. Uh, they actually uh, give the, the budgets and stuff to the sheriff department. Uh, they work with the mayor. I want to work with the mayor and with all of the departments of Greene County to, number one, 
uh, help reduce the drug trafficking and the drug uh, issue that we have in Greene County uh, to try to help get some more in the industry, uh, some more uh, stuff like that into Greene County. Um, but to do that in a professional manner, not to go up there to fight against these departments as we have seen in the past, but to be there to be a support and to be a help and try to give them the resources that they need to be able to operate their departments. On the other hand of that is also there needs to be accountability. Uh, as running departments in the uh, automotive industry, I've run departments on a budget, but I also had to give an account for that budget and show where I was spending that money. And I feel like that's what we need to do is not just uh, throw the money out there and work with them and give them the resources, but have an expected result. Uh, Sheriff's Department, we want to give you more money uh, to fight crime. We want to, but then we need to see the results. How much has crime come down? How, what are we getting for our money? That's what the people of Greene County, I feel like, um, are looking at it this time is they want to see where's their money been spent and what are they getting back for that money and is there anything else you'd like to say before we go i know i would like to i would like to say that uh, i am joe Hauser, running for fifth district county commissioner and i would appreciate people's vote and thank you again for having us in this interview and wgrv that is joseph hauser he is running in the fifth district on the republican ticket this is reed seals for am 1340 wgrv